Hi, Michael here, looking at Meditations on Manhood, 100 Devotions from Charles Spurgeon, looking at the section, Diseases Fatal to Happiness, and the verse used is from Psalms 42.11, I shall yet praise him who is the health of my countenance and my God. Reading this again, Psalms 42.11 I shall yet praise him who is the health of my countenance and my God. The great thing to be desired by all of us is that we may in spirit, soul, and body be whole. That is to say, holy. For holiness in very truth, the holiness of our entire manhood. Sin is disease. Righteousness is health. We all need to be healed, that being healed we may be healthy, that receiving the divine restoration our nature may arrive at perfect soundness. Today a measure of health is essential to our happiness. If any man here burns with the fever of lust, he cannot be a happy man. In the fierce heat of passion he may think himself blessed, but he dares not deny that in those intervals of chill, remorse which alternate with the heat of passion, woe and anguish are his portion. Anger, envy, revenge, covetousness, discontent, pride, and self-will are all diseases fatal to happiness. Perhaps some man before me in utterly given up to the worldliness and lethargy has seized upon him, and in the deadness of that lethargy he complains of no pain whatsoever, but finds a happiness in the numbness of spiritual death. May God deliver you from this hideous peace, this horrible stupefaction, for it is not true happiness, but the herald of eternal death. Absolute happiness that which will bear the looking at real joy, peace, felicity, can never come to a man while one part of his nature jars with the other. He must be right with himself. The little universe of our nature cannot sing in harmony till its central sun of faith, its planetary affections, and even the, those imaginations which are comparable to the comets are each and all in their fit sphere and orbits. Then as they all, like the heavens, declare the glory of God, all will be well. We must be spiritually healthy, or we cannot be happy.